Roxy lashing out. She needs some of the blame, and that is, none of this is your fault, right? I've uh, come to arrest the Roxy's stuff. I've got to go. No, no, no. No. Alfred, please. No. It's all right. Don't you know. I'll sure I get it packed up for you tonight. You really are a mug, aren't you? She stood here less than a year ago, told everyone she was putting her about behind your back. I don't talk about her like yeah. stupid. You have to be the fool for it all over I again. I haven't fallen for anything. Right? I wanted this. I wanted this. And I know you're all talking behind our backs, and I get it. But I'm the one who broke Roxy's heart, and I'm gonna have to. I'm gonna have to live with that for the rest of my life. But the truth is. The truth is, I couldn't live with that cat a minute longer, so. So everything that's happened is down to me. It's my fault, all right? Just me, and you, d you don't need to blame her. Listen, Kat. I love you, right? And I don't care who knows. Right. When you think that's it, dear? <laughs> well, you just get your happy ending. You better watch yourself. Because this ain't over. <laughs>